You see Avery Bradley today? Yes. And he's joining the Utah Jazz staff. Love it. How great is that? They'll play full court defense. Yes, now. they will. <laughs> Player development yep. role for, for Avery. Great to see. what the discussion is here exactly yeah. Mark. and a good time to point out and remind everybody we're going to be speaking with landry fields the general manager of the atlanta hawks in the second quarter we're just underway here in the first quarter with 539 to go in the first period atlanta leading by five and recherche with a couple of field goals The French Low Pro League is a very competitive professional league. Kemba Walker played for Monaco in that league this past year. And hey, shout out Kemba Walker on his retirement. Oh, man. All I, love for him. Mark, I covered the, the run to the Big East title when they had to play like five consecutive days and cardiac Kemba was at yes. his absolute best. Had a good experience over in Monaco, principality on its own. And, you know, one of the most ridiculous things I heard was, oh, it's too bad that he had to be relegated to playing in Monaco at the end of his career. Oh, it's a tough life over there. Have you ever been to Monaco? It's a tough life for poor Kemba. <laughs> Home of the $25 beer, <laughs> if you're into that. You think about what Kemba has done. You think about the Connecticut program in its history. Players that have come out of that institution. George knocks down the first foul shot. Pardon me. Gay knocks down the first foul shot for the Hawks. Muhammad Gay out of Washington State. 39th pick last year. Goes two for two. And now they spring a little 1-2-1-1 one, one, one full court pressure. Or man pressure straight up. Sar showing off a little bit of handle, Doris Burke. Sure was. But I like the pressure from Gay and how intense he was. Just takes a bad angle once he's not turned around. I'd love to see that, Mark. Okay, spring it quick. The big man just trying to pressure another big man. Sar comfortable against yep. the pressure. Here he is in the mid-range. It's Butler for three. Good offense by the Wizards. Richeche bobs it up. Whistle and a foul underneath. As Miles Norris out of UC Santa Barbara will go to the free throw line. The Washington Wizards signed Jonas Valanciunas during the offseason in free agency so I wonder how that impacts Saar in the front court and what the vision is for the Washington Wizards moving forward as an organization you know, I think back to the days when Bradley Beal and John Wall were playing and they were consistently in the playoffs now they were not advancing they had I don't think they ever got to 50 wins but the last time the Washington Wizards won even at least 40 games, you got to go all the way back to 2018. Wow. A season ago, just 15 and 67. And I love the move. You, you turned Brian Keith from the interim head coach to now the head coach. We will talk to Will Dawkins at some point yep. today. I look forward to that conversation. Dawkins, the general manager for the Wizards, and... Into the depth chart as it stands right now. Malcolm Brogdon. And Butler behind him. Poole, Kuzma, Saar, and Valanciunas, who did not play with the Lithuanian national team in Olympic qualification. Here's Richache. A little bit strong and rebounded by the Wizards. Johnny Davis goes around the world. Davis, great dive inside. And good defense by the Hawks. Cross-court pass never found its target. But it's going to go out of bounds off of Johnny Davis. Juricic has a proclivity for those cross-court passes and usually finds his guy. That time he didn't.
back out front. Curse it's one more to the corner. Gay left it short. And Juricic. They got the travel got first. The travel yeah. first. He, oh, it was going to be an offensive uh, block, pardon me. Juricic, you know, anticipating where this is going, jumps in front of that ball hand. We're going to force a turnover. This is good anticipation. He just sees it developing, goes for a steal, but it's, yeah. it's his movement initially which causes that travel. This is a guy who played on the Serbian national team. You know, an opportunity. They said they wanted to expose him to being a primary ball handler. You can see why. And holding up very well so far. Quitting himself well. Nice spin move. Sprays it out for three. Almost rebounded by the Wizards out of bounds. It'll stay at this end. Atlanta basketball. Risha Shea is still in the ball game for Atlanta. Played a little over six minutes so far. We just saw Dalton Connett play a lot of minutes for the yes. Los Angeles Lakers. I feel like he played the entirety of the first quarter. I wonder if that's in store for Risha Shea. Another shot attempt. Boy, he kicked yeah. it off quick. Showed some good handle to make some space too, Doris. On the drive inside, a whistle and a foul. He's going to put Omaruyi on the free throw line. Out of Oregon. Be two shots for him. Each of the teams in Summer League will play four games and then they'll see the teams based on a litany of stats and wins. Get to the playoffs. Hey, the Emirates NBA Cup tips off November 12th. Circle it on your calendar. The much-anticipated tournament returns with all 30 teams competing in group play and eight advancing to the knockout rounds. But only one champion will capture the NBA Cup. Visit NBA.com slash NBA Cup to learn more. And I absolutely love the heightened level of competition in those games last year. And you alluded to the fact that it helped the Pacers prepare for the playoffs and the intensity they would do. You had so many of their guys who had never experienced playoff basketball. Rick Carlisle touched on the fact that playing in those games, uh, the opportunity to play at home with pressure on the line, the opportunity to advance, he said it, it immeasurably helped his group. Nice pass by Funk. And a foul inside. Maruyi will go back to the free throw line. He's been active. Huh? Yeah. 6'6", 240. Out of Oregon. She went undrafted in 2021. It's all conference in the Pac-12. Knocks down the first free throw. He had his deal converted from a two-way deal to a regular deal in March of last season. Four-point Atlanta lead. Under three and a half to go in the opening quarter. Wallace off the double dribble.